Hey my squidlings, it's Katie here and welcome back to another Tuesday tutorial video. Um, as you can see from the title of this video, I actually changed the name of the tutorial series just to Katie's How To's because I figured that covers a broader range because um, I initially just decided I was going to do the basics, that's where Doodle or Survival Guide came from, and now maybe I might branch off into random things that aren't necessary to the basics. So. Yeah, so I was requested to do um, male hairstyles, and I want to disclaimer that I'm not super great at men. I'm actually kind of growing into drawing them, but I'm not super comfortable. But I am going to share with you some hairstyles that I am comfortable sharing. Um, so there's four heads here, so I'm going to be doing four different hairstyles, and they're kind of just basic and you can definitely make tweaks to these and or like longer back hair I mean you could change these any way you want I mean they're pretty versatile um, so without further ado let's just I guess get into it so the first hairstyle I want to focus on is kind of like a hairstyle that has like bangs in the front a little bit longer in the back but it's not like super long I don't know how to explain it I'll just show you so first what you're gonna want to do is kind of get a general idea of a hairstyle that you want to do. Maybe look up some Google images or just Google hairstyles for men, stuff like that. Um, and I'm just going to uh, start from the middle here and I'm going to make like a long kind of weird triangle and keep it really loose when you're sketching stuff because this is definitely not your final product or anything. This is going to be like a giant tuft of hair in the middle. You can break it up however you want. But, yeah. And then uh, I'm going to come over here and add like a little hair. Maybe it broke off, wasn't long enough to fall in line with this. And then I'm going to curve another line this way and kind of come down and make like a little hair strand because that's what I like to do. Um, so we've got that. Now let's work on the other side. Now this side is going to be different than the other side. Um, I'm actually just going to take a hair and curve it this way. And it's going to be like a little curvy hair. Like that. Except that's a little too high. There we go. This is kind of like a messy hair style. Like just the person had messy hair. And then I'm going to kind of follow the curve of the line that I have here to make the basis of the head and I'm going to make little like bumps because the hair is supposed to be somewhat messy and then I'm going to make a hair come off here as like a little sticky up hair and you can do that anywhere you want just to kind of fill in gaps. going to add some hair in the back down under here and this one's going to be a little bit longer in the back and you can do anything with these hairstyles if you just want to have it long on top and short in the back you don't have to add all these little long hairs but there is the first hairstyle it's actually really simple just keep it sketchy and practice a lot I mean Basically, if you think about a girl, like if you're better at drawing girls, think about a girl's hairstyle and like some girls have short hair, you can always apply those short haired like concepts to a guy, maybe make it less like curly, unless a guy has curly hair, then whatever, um, but you can always apply girl hairstyles to guys, I mean, guys have braids and long hair too, so yeah. Anyway, let's move to the next hairstyle. This one's going to be, it's kind of inspired by a video game character for me, but I like it. Um, but it's just inspired, it's not like the exact hairstyle or anything. So, first I'm going to start on this side of the head, so kind of off to the side. And I'm going to make like a little diagonal line and I'm going to bring it down. I'm going to do the same with the other side. So they kind of look like like bangs, I guess, like side bangs. Then I'm going to take from that point and make it like a little triangle and round it off here and then connect these two points. Do the same to the other side. So we've got something that looks like this and I will erase 
this because hair is not see through. And then next I'm going to add the little hairline under here because it is flipped over so you're going to see that. And I'm going to add the hairline here. If you want you can always add like a little hair right there as well. And uh, then I'm going to go from the top of the head here and I'm going to make a couple points where like the back of the hair would be you know sticking up a little bit because this is also kind of a longer hair he's gonna have like a part down the middle so I'm gonna do that just kind of loosely indicating it and uh, yeah I mean this one's really simple for me anyway just kind of like a longish hairstyle I think but I think it looks really good I like it then next one we're gonna do over here is kind of just like a basic hairstyle at least it is for me um, I'm just gonna start on this side I'm just gonna put a bunch of bang lines in, and they're all curving towards the same side so I'm not gonna really bother indicating individual strands and then I'm gonna add some like little tufts of hair over here and then I'm gonna round it off maybe he combed his hair this morning And then just follow through with it around the head and then maybe make some points to where it goes to the neck and then you can always add like little scraggly lines if you feel the need for it and yeah I think I'm gonna make these bangs a wee bit longer though because yeah it looks a little girly and if you're going for a more guy hairstyle longer bangs is better at least in my opinion and this is also like depending on like tastes like it just depends on what you like and hairstyles honestly like, if you would rather have sideburns instead of those little tufts on the side, then do that. I mean, it's just, it really depends on what you like. And then the last hairstyle is um, one that I really like, but I've never really used it, but I do like it. Alright, so, I'm going to start over here, in the middle probably, and I'm going to make a line upward like that. And it may look weird now, but it'll look good at so then you're going to make another line, a little bit shorter, and kind of do that all the way around. And you're going to add another one over here, maybe another one here. So it looks like he has spikes coming out of his head. Uh, then I'm going to add a couple little tufts of hair. Like I said, if you don't want to do the little tufts of hair, you can always add just like little, little squares for um, sideburns. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to curve this line and point it upward so they meet like that. You can do that to all of these. You can make them as thick or as thin as you want. Okay, now it looks like a little flower. <laughs> um, and then you're just going to want to add some in the back so he looks like he has hair. Um, and you can always like add less or more or whatever. And then I'm just going to add some little hairs back here. Um, I think I'm going to erase some lines just so it's not as liney. I don't know if that makes any sense. Sometimes I find when I have too many lines it looks weird. So yeah, it's just, you know, hairstyles for me are really simple. All you've got to do is just sketch it out and have a general mindset of what you want to do with the hair and you can generally go with it pretty well. If you have some kind of reference to go off of those are definitely helpful as well. Alrighty guys, so I really hope you found this tutorial useful and helpful and all that stuff because I really like doing this stuff for you and I don't know, it really makes my day when you guys request me to do tutorials. So anyway, if you do have a tutorial request, leave it in the comments down below. Also, don't forget to like the video if you enjoyed it or found it helpful. And don't forget to subscribe to join our cute little squid army if you haven't already to keep updated on when I upload a new video. And until next time guys, toodaloo!